we're looking at our uh, new G5000H integrated flight deck for medium lift helicopters. We're bringing our touchscreen user interface uh, where you've got access to the displays, the systems. So if it's something on the rotorcraft that we can talk to, you can control it through this central user, this touchscreen user interface. We're also bringing synthetic vision. Uh, no matter what operating conditions you're operating in, you'll be able to see outside the aircraft. And so now we're bringing this 24-7 um, VFR view of the world uh, right on displays. I'll have access to see um, traffic, they'll be able to see terrain, they'll be able to see obstacles. So operators, even in low visibility conditions, nighttime conditions, they're still going to have access to this amazing situational awareness tool that our fixed wing customers uh, and our customers on the G1000H have been enjoying for some time. And it integrates seamlessly with traffic, with terrain, with obstacles, with heliports. You'll be able to see all of these things on the displays in nighttime and in low visibility conditions. Tell me about uh, the technology in this system and has it tra uh, transferred over from some other area like fixed wing? Uh, these are the type of uh, features that are currently flying on the Cessna Citation 10 and our G5000 integrated flight deck. So we're taking this, these applications that we're learning on the fixed wing side, listening specifically to the rotorcraft customers and then designing features for them. So a lot of this is already either present in the um, fixed wing um, market or um, you know, will be coming to the uh, the medium lift market and you know other markets. Give me an idea of what Telligent is all about. Sure, Telligent's voice control, that's our automatic speech recognition. So our next generation G5000H flight deck, um, the operators will have the capability uh, by speaking to the system to um, can command certain functions. So at this point in time, they can switch radios, they can switch uh, the radio they're talking on, they can play back the last air traffic control frequency or um, last air traffic control um, transmission. So there's a lot of different things we can do uh, by integrating the voice control into the uh, G5000H. Yeah, everything that in the G5000H has, its main goal is to reduce the workload of that operator. So what we're doing is we're seamlessly integrating all of these things either to the display or what they're hearing. So they'll be able to see traffic, they'll be able to see terrain, uh, they'll be able to see obstacles, they'll be able to see their flight path, all these things right on the display. We'll be able to integrate the voice control so where without keeping their hands on the, um, the collective and the cyclic, they'll still be able to make voice commands to the system uh, so they can keep their eyes forward and focused on what they're doing. And three-dimensional audio features like that where um, you'll be able to hear uh, different frequencies coming uh, spatially at different locations. All these types of things are built at reducing the workload in the cockpit. So what we've done is we've tried to build, pull, integrate as many things as possible and present them in a way that makes it easier for the operator to operate their aircraft.